Hello everyone. Good morning. This is Pastor Tim from Light Christian Center. I just thought I'd get on this morning. I just want to say a few things. I just want to encourage you today. Um, we serve a God who is true and faithful in all areas of our life. Right now it seems as though everyone is in a panic mode. Everyone is in an emergency mode. So I thought I'd give you a 911 scripture. How about that? So here it is. Uh, it's a 911 scripture, Psalms 911. It says, Sing praises to the Lord, you who sits enthroned in Zion. Tell among the people his deeds. Sing praises to the Lord, church, this morning. Sing praises to his name. We're going to praise him in the good times. We're going to praise him in the bad times. Amen. We're going to praise him when we're up, and we're going to praise him when we're down. Praise him when you're sick. Praise him when you're well. Amen. Praise Him when your pockets are full, church. Praise Him when your pockets are empty. And all things this morning, let's give Him praise. And don't let your circumstances determine if you praise God or not. Don't let your circumstances determine if you praise God or not. You praise Him in the good times and the bad times. You praise Him now and you praise Him loud. Scream it from the rooftop. Scream it from the mountaintop. And look, during our time of separation and uncertainty, let us remember all the good things the Lord has done. Let us remember His mercy and His grace He showed on, on Noah and his family when He saved them from the flood. Let us remember how He brought Joseph from the, from the pit to the palace. Amen. Let us remember how he, he brought the Israelites out of bondage from Egypt. Let us remember how He parted the Red Sea for Moses. And over a million people walked across on dry land. Let us remember the good things. Let us remember how he gave David victory over Goliath. Let us remember that he gave sight to the blind. Let us remember that he gave healing to the hurting. Provision for those who were in poverty. Hope to the hopeless church and, and mercy to the broken. Let us remember that he sent his son, his only son, Jesus Christ to die for a lost and broken generation. Let us remember that church. And in all of our remembering church, let us not forget that He conquered death, hell, and the grave in Jesus' name. Let us not forget that Jesus rose again on the third day. Let us not forget that we are born again, Holy Spirit-filled, demon-destroying Christians. Let us not forget who we are and whose we are. COVID-19, coronavirus, we rebuke you in the name above every name, Jesus Christ. We command you to cease. We command you to stop in the name of Jesus. We command you to die right where you are. Don't be afraid, church. There are more for you than there are against you. If you can see me now, I want you to repeat after me. I ain't scared. I ain't going to doubt. I ain't going to panic, and I ain't going to walk in fear, because my God, say it with me, my God, say it louder, my God is greater. God bless you all. I love you. Walk in peace today. Walk in victory. Don't walk in fear. Don't be afraid. Stand your ground. Push back the gates of hell, and I'll see you when I see you.